So I've seen this comment, something like this often about when you talk about steam pricing is uh, make the price uh, expensive enough so that you can put it on sale. So while but often sales and marketing can feel manipulative or something like that, this is clearly that. And one of our kind of rules is being honest with communication and being honest with um, how we think of these interactions, including price. And so we thought that's a dishonest interaction. Now, I'm not calling you a liar or anything. Don't, don't worry, don't worry. Like, this is a really common way to think about it. Uh, but so for us, we're just like, hey, that's kind of a weird thing of people are going to feel cheated maybe or, or, or not happy because what we want to have happen is you play the game and you're like, this is awesome. Oh my God, I got to tell my friends so that we can all play together. And then they buy the game and they're going to look at the price and they're going to be like, it's an inflated price because they're going to wait for a sale then. Rather, we just said, hey, what's the price that you just don't blink at? And that's $19.99. So now when someone's friend really likes the game, they can just buy the game and they get it at a reasonable price and they don't feel bad. That's kind of like our feeling on that. And again, not knocking the original poster or anything like this and saying they're evil or manipulative. But like there are a lot of manipulative pricing things you can do that maybe would generate up our sales more. But, you know, it's how we think about our relationship with, with the community. The other th one I saw was somebody said, oh, I'm releasing a game for the first time. Uh, it's a side project. I don't really care about money. I'm going to release it for 99 cents. I would say don't. Release it for $4.99, $2.99, something more so that you can play with price because you'll learn. Like we can learn what do sales look like? What do sales look like in different territories? Like every time you put something out into the world, try to learn something from it. Uh, and so if you do it at 99 cents, you kind of limit what you can learn. You can learn if 99 cent game works, right? I think they're allowed to go down to four, 49 cents, but I mean, come on. <sighs> no one's learning anything between there. So I price it a little higher in this so you can learn and then maybe you'll end up at 99 cents. We changed our price. We changed our price from 29.99 to 19.99 because we talked to the community about it. So, you know, play around with the pricing, but I really don't like to do the manipulative kind of thing or thinking we need it to be higher because we're gonna put it on sale. You know what, if you put it on sale, it just means it's a better deal. I don't know, like, man, maybe I'm the wrong person for this. Maybe I don't know what I'm talking about. That could be true too. Uh, so as always, there's a lot of stuff written about this. Read up on it, look at it, and kind of make your own best guess.